Hello everyone, I will be showing you the McFarlane accessory pack in this video, but before we start, here's a sneak peek at what they look like, and thank you for watching, and yeah, here's the video. <laughs> so, this is a box, and it has a little rake on the back that shows you what is in it, but let's open it. Let's take a look. Comes in the packaging. I think this it has some little of this silver uh, clear packaging on it so it can't just fall out. So we have to <laughs> do that. And then I'll just come out. And these will really work great right with any kind of McFarlane figures from. Spawn to your DC multiverse. Yeah, which like Batman. But the reason um how McFarlane comes out with these is because the the toys they don't come with guns, not anymore. Even characters that usually would come with a gun, you know, Bloodsport, uh, Red Hood. You know, some characters you might think naturally come with guns, but they don't want to promote guns, so. No guns with DC Multiverse, so if you want to add those accessories to your figures, you're going to have to get yourself. Where we got this from? It was $20. Accessory pack. It was $20 from where we got it from, so let's just show them off. Alright, first gun. I'm gonna, uh, now this is a... Let's bring the camera a little bit closer for this. <laughs> what is this one? Now that's a small snub nose revolver, is what they call it, snub nose, because it's a little bit shorter barrel, like a snub nose, and it's a revolver, so it's like a six shooter, maybe something you might see penguin carrying, maybe. Mhm. Mm so we just like penguin and just like let's see if I can get it in his hand. And it fits pretty well with them. It looks pretty good on Bing when I say. Cool. Yep. And the next one is just more pistols. Like this one. I'd say it's similar to the last one. Another revolver like the pink one had there. But just a little bit longer barrel. It's so, like a deagle. So you might see that with like Two-Face or somebody maybe. And then there's these two little. Those matching guns. Mm -hmm. This one I feel like Two Fists would have. I could be mistaken, but I believe those are called Lugers. L U G E R. German guns. Nice they get a, a matching pair, though. Mm hmm. I like dual pistols. And then these. Oh, sorry. <coughs> and then these two next ones, they're kind of not realistic. We have yeah. this one. Call that a ray gun? <laughs> It can be used for a lot of things, though. You can, you you can know, paint it and make it look like Killer Moth's gun. You can do a lot of it. And really, that's the type of gun you can, you know, say you it, it almost, shoots whatever you want it to shoot. Almost any alien or human thing. Next one is this gun. This gun. Which uh, looks like a shrink ray or something. A shrink ray or something. Another alien gun of some sort. Yeah. Which, it does match Joker if you want to give it to him. Or maybe a laughing gas gun. Mm-hmm. Like we have Joker right here. If you have this Joker, I think this one is the best one for it. But you can just... Give him the gun right there. And it okay. looks really good for him. Alright. Next one, we have this big... Looks like a cork gun. Yeah. Kind of a cartoonish, you know, cork gun. That might be something Harley Quinn or Joker had for some reason. Or or a henchman of theirs. Yeah. Now, uh, the rest of these are more realistic guns again. Well. Sure. For the most part. Yeah. Um, we have this SMG. Some machine gun. Good looking gun to go with, you know, Red Hood, Bloodsport. Uh, that's true. He would have a fast shooting gun. He has another SMG. It looks like a. 
may have seen that gun in Call of Duty or something before in if you play anything like that. Um, it looks like a tactical submachine gun, I think. I think that's the name. Next one is this one. It's a big golden pistol. Which I think, if we grab Frankenstein over here, and we can just give him this and his sword. And if he wasn't scary enough, oh yeah, Frankenstein. With a gun. gun. <laughs> I think he looks pretty good with that gun. Mm -hmm. I don't think it'd fit in a whole lot of other people's hands. So a, a big fig works well. Yep. Put him over there. Next one. This one. Kind of an old, old looking gun. I'd say. Maybe like an old pirate gun. It's got the big fat barrel. It's like a fart gun. <laughs> I don't think like they used to be able to stick any kind of metal down into here and they could fire it, but an old school looking gun still cool. Uh, I believe this here is a rifle. One of the first rifles we're gonna see. Pretty cool. It's kind of got that gunmetal gray color. Then it like has a lot of them little do. handlebar at the top that you can hold from here or underneath. And then we have. Rifle with a scope. Uh -huh. on it. it actually has a, a lot of attachments on it. It has a really long barrel there. It had this big mag. Has it? It had this scope and this big little handle thing. Oh, pretty long barrel. Nice, nice rifle for any character. Next one is this gun, but it also comes with this little double barrel drums. Yeah. And you can just actually take out the magazine. That's pretty cool. And you just plop it in there like that. And I got this cool gun with that. Nice. I like that gun. One of the bigger guns almost. We're we'll getting to some of the big guns now. Yeah. Now we have this big rifle. Now that's a nice size rifle. It looks like a normal start assault rifle or something. It was broken. See? Now this is a really big sniper thing. Sniper rifle? Yes. Big sniper rifle. Looks like very long. You got characters that are marksmen that uh might have a sniper rifle. You might see like <laughs> Grifter maybe having it. I can see Grifter. You see like a bodyguard? You might be sniping someone. But then for the last one, it's this big mini gun. But if you just take these two things and connect them like that. Big drum underneath the gun. And just put it, plop it right down here in this hole. And there you go. Yeah. What a cool gun. Mm -hmm. I think these guns are really cool. For the most part, do you uh, uh, have a favorite? A favorite? Hmm. Think, you think about it while you eat that muffin, and I'll tell you my favorite. I think I really like the double barreled rifle here, or shotgun, maybe that is. And. And believe it or not, this gun, because it just goes so well for so many characters, can carry that little one. I think my favorite guns, one of them is probably, no, these two small guns. The matching pistols. Mm -hmm, the little dual pistols. And I think this one is probably, this one is probably like my favorite one. Very cool. Yeah. Overall, give this accessory pack a rating. Mm, I would give this accessory pack a mm, eight point five. I'll give it a nine point one. Nine point one. So 
So that would be 17.6. We're getting better. Well, thanks for watching. Wait, but before we do. I was just kidding. Before we end, uh, I think we, we should set some characters up holding them. Okay, let's do that. So we can see what it would look like with them. There we go. We have them characters. Set it up. And just like that, we have Frankenstein holding his big revolver and his sword back here. We have Red Hood, Red Hood holding his SMG, Grifter holding a, a rifle. You can see it. We have Joker holding his. It's called the laughing gas gun. We'll call it the laughing gas gun. Batman's holding two revolver things. Two pistols. Two pistols. We have Bloodsport here holding this big gun. And we have Penguin holding that gun. And that's it. So, and we have all the other guns just like over here. But, um, that's a, that's a good. This is a good accessory pack. You should get it if you can. And yeah. Bye.